I think a fitting tribute would be to slight her rival Nocturne, perhaps. I have found the supposed whereabouts of the Bow of Shadows, and if you steal it from her chosen champion, perhaps Azura will favor you. Okay, but 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 then wouldn't Nocturna not favor me? And I, I I don't want to go into too many details, but that would be a very bad idea. Bow of Shadows. Okay, I've got to admit, I want whatever that is. And I suppose maybe Nocturna would actually be happy because, because, well, look, again, I don't want to go into too many details, but maybe she would prefer a different champion to have the Bow of Shadows, yeah? Maybe? Okay, where is it? The Bow of Shadows is currently in the possession of a Khajiit hunter who can be found in the Falkreath area. And I do have a few other things to sort out there, including a vampire that is masquerading as a travelling merchant, and apparently a relic called the Model Cannon that's found in the Pale Pass. But we've now got the tonal staff of Kagras, so we could drop down into the sightless pit and find the entrance to the Temple of Zrib. Plus, in the Winterhold area, we also need to go and check out Deepholm, which is our new secret lair. So many things to do, so many choices to make. Plus, I do need to go to the Bard's College and speak to a Bard who did leave a prayer with the Night Mother. Before we do that, though, let's just go and see if the guys are back. Orion is back, so I'm assuming the Explorers are back too. And I do need to speak to Latoria. What a beautiful day. Is that snow? <sighs> so the instant I say, what a beautiful day, it starts snowing. Because of course it does. The sound of footsteps. What a beautiful sound. Hello. Something you need. Okay. That was a little. Okay. Right. I need to speak to many of you. Latoria. Really, you're going to bed? Haven't you just got up? Okay, it was a power nap. It was a power nap. Good day. Um, hi. How is the day treating you? Did you discover anything interesting in those books I oh, left yes. you? Latoria deciphered a new spell tome from some of the ruined books you brought her. Latoria made an extra copy for you as well. Okay, that's that's very nice. I'm sure it'll be very, very wolf skin. Pretty sure I've got that. Um, I do have some more books. Hi, some more books Hello. for you. Burned books. If you could possibly decipher these. Where are you? You're not going back to bed, are you? Wonderful day, is it not? It, it is, although it does seem to be somewhat confused as to what weather it wishes to uh, provide. I've got some ruined books for you. Ah, excellent. Let's see what you have found. Ah, good, good. It will take some time to decipher these. Come back tomorrow, and Latoria will let you know what she has found out. Right, okay, and we do need some fragments. So if you could nip out... What do you want? ...and do some digging, that would be great. Of course, Guildmaster. Excellent! Oh, it is really good to have these guys back. Something you need. Kaya, Kia. Hi there. Okay. I have Something a job. Something you need. Yes. Um, I'd like you to go out and excavate. All right. And Marassi, are you who I need to speak? Good day. To, no, you're... Okay, no, we're not planning any digs soon, are we? I really could do with you guys just hanging around for a little while. Okay. I've got a job for you. Mm -hmm. Go out and excavate. All right, then. 
Excellent. I think I'm going to leave you here because... How is your day faring? You do... What do you need? Sell things on occasion that I've are... I've got a little of everything you'll need for your next expedition. Do you have fragments? You do! That's pretty much all I need, I think. Think you don't usually have anything that I would um Ooh. No. Thought for a second maybe you would have sweet rolls. You do have ebony ingots. Come on back if you need anything. No, the person I'm really looking for is Madras. Y you what time is it? I haven't seen the sky all day. Okay. So that's staying with us now, is it? Along with that. Right. Okay, uh what time is it? I haven't seen the sky all day. Yeah, you mentioned that. Right. Yes. What I is it? I found these curious schematics. What do you make of them? Oh, Eggleman, do you see this? These are fantastic. They show how to construct a Dwemer planetarium. It will take a thing or two to make it happen, though. Gears, cogs, gyros, more dynamo cores than you can shake a stick at. Dwemer bronze by the cartload. No simple task, I assure you, but I can make it happen with your help. What do you think? You, you want to build a planetarium here? Here, in solitude? Aren't they kind of large? Go easy. On the sweet rolls. Aren't they kind of large? I'm wondering if Elisif might have an issue with that, but okay, fine. Yes, yeah, sure. Planetarium, why not? Oh, uh, actually, I was talking to Eggleman, but you're more than welcome to help as well. Might get done quicker that way. Here is a list of what I will certainly need right offhand to get started. The rest I'll let you know as I figure out as you bring the rest. You were, t you were talking to the little... Really? I mean, just, hey, quarried stone, metal ingots, sawn logs. I mean, fantastic then. If you if you want to give the job to him to go fetch all the stuff, although what time is it? I can't I imagine that is going to be a, a quick job if we leave it to Engelman. <sighs> Okay, so we need... What, what, what do we need? Five iron fittings. Pretty sure we got those. 25 logs for Madras. Pretty sure... Oh, we definitely got those. 40 Dwemer metal ingots. Got those. 75 quarter... I'm pretty sure we've got the quarried stone as well. So we're going to have a planetarium. It... In a go. Next time, I, um... Look at the sky and start to look happy and say something along the lines of, Oh, what a beautiful day. Feel free to just lightly cuff me around the ear. Because apparently, that's just tempting fate a little too much. Okay. I keep forgetting, you do not like that drop, do you? You do not like that drop. I mean, I, I really have asked Orion to put a, a guardrail there for you, but uh, he's not really paying any attention. Right, so we need a lot of... We don't have quarried... Oh, the quarried stone. It's probably still at the third field station. It's at the field station. Do we have Dwemer? Dwarven metal ingots we got loads of. Right, didn't he say we also needed Dwarven cores and... Did he say cogs? I've got... I've got a few... I've got... I've got some gears and gyros and... Oh god, do you think we're going to be going on a... on a Dwemer stuff hunt? Alright, so we're going to need some quarried stone. There is a source of quarried stone down by the farm near to the carriage. 
Should we get that sorted now so he can just get started on his planetarium? We probably should. We probably should just... Ooh. I don't suppose you want to do the digging for the quarried stone, do you? I mean, we, we could ask some of the farmers if they want to do it, but I suspect the answer's going to be a fairly firm, uh, no. Although I suppose adding er uh before that makes it sound less firm. You, you could get the quarried stone, you know. Or you could just stand around in the yard looking vaguely useless. Right, okay. We also, we need to go and speak to somebody in the Bard's College. I'm wondering who that would be. Is it one of the Bard's I know well? I say know well, by that I mean have had a vague conversation with that some point in the past. Yes! Sweet. Keeps making eyes at me. You Sweet should tell him to mind his own business. Okay. Aya, you're so mean. I don't think he means anything by it. No. I do not recognize that. Okay. Got to make a good entrance here. We have to make an entrance. Come here. Come here. Get out of sight. You stay. Whistle if you need me, okay? There. Yes. I'm, um... I'm going to, uh, try to make a good entrance. Let's go with them. Ouch. Wait. Who are you? Oh, I remember you. Right. I am an invisible shadow. Nobody sees me coming. Nobody sees me leaving. Okay, which, which side is the most dramatic? I say here. Your performance has been excellent lately, Aya. You still need training, but... I believe you, you are looking for us. Yes. You're the assassin, Thank right? Look. There's this reckless mage in the Frozen Hearth Inn in Winterhold. I want him dead. This gold should cover it. Winterhold? It will be done. Winterhold? Okay. On my way. There are a lot of people in Winterhold, who people want dead. I mean, it, 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 it could just be a coincidence, but that is the second contract we've had to take care of someone in Winterhold. And it is convenient. We are heading off Hello, in... Oh, uh, I'm not your friend. I am a dark, shadowy figure. Okay, I forgot to take the bloody... What was I doing? Okay, moving on. Seriously, I would pay you a hundred gold for the future and leave the past be. to That's do some mining mind. for me. Two hundred gold. I will pay you two hundred gold to mine this stone for me. Hmm? That's a lot of three hundred. Yes. I regret I cannot do that. You, you can. You can. You just want to watch me do it. Moving out. You just enjoy. What? With a wife like Frederica and a son like Horn, I'm the luckiest man in Skyrim. You could be the luckiest man in Skyrim and be 500 coins richer if you need something. Quarried stone. I don't want to buy a horse. I'll buy a horse if you quarry stone for me. How much are your horses? That's what I'm here for. What are you offering? <sighs> Never mind. If you're heading up to Solitude, you should stop to check out the view on your way. It's a good one. Yes, I'll, I'll try to remember doing that after doing this back-breaking labor. 
I think this is just some weird Nordic custom where they enjoy making thanes do menial labor just because it gives them, uh, I don't know. Look at you go. You are a mining machine. You are not getting any more sweet rolls today. I'm just saying. That's it. Put your back into it. You are doing well. I am going to find a way to make you pay for that. Okay. I can see the smirk. I will not be purchasing any horses from this stable. This the My husband Gaiman handles the business. Ever. Just letting you know. And 40 ingots. Yes. Okay. And now I'm, of course, overloaded by almost 200. Can I overcome that with... No, I can't. Not quite. Okay. Oh, we could pick the backpack up, I suppose. <sighs> Shouldn't take that long to get there, he says. Already feeling it. I have no idea where you think you're going, but I have got what you need. Yes? What have is it? Got the supplies you needed. Oh, great. Yes, these will do nicely. Give me a couple of days to get started. Then you might be able to help me with the next phase. <sighs> Will it involve... quarrying stone? Because if so, I'm not totally sure you and I are going to be best friends for much longer. I'm trying to decide if you're walking any slower. Okay, so we've got a planetarium on its way. I make it sound like I've ordered it and someone's going to bring it. I've... We've got a planetarium planned and the builders will start building it. Now we have to decide where we are heading next. Because honestly, I'm torn on this. I really do want to see our new you know, secret lair. I really want to see our secret lair. But I also want to go and get something called the Bow of Shadows. We really should prioritize getting that relic, I guess, before the trail grows cold, so to speak. I mean, Deep Home and the Sightless Pit are hardly going to go anywhere, whereas a hunter carrying a bow could well do so. Have you... Have you been following what's going on here? Do you, do you remember how it all started? A shattered amulet. An amulet that was apparently worn by hey, all of the kings. Said? It's called the Amulet of Kings and can only be worn by the Dragonborn. And then we found a shield that somehow reacted to the amulet. And it turned out it was the shield of... Was it... Reman? Reman Cyrodiil. I think it was Reman Cyrodiil, something like that. Who was apparently also dragonborn. And then Orion found some sort of link between the dragonborn and the Nerevarim. Which has something to do with Morrowind. And so then we went off and got a ring worn by the Nerevarim. In fact, it could only be worn by the Nerevarim. And it's cursed. And to lift the curse, we need to find, well, what is, a, I suppose, a Daedric artifact. Um, so as to gain favour with Azura. And that will lift the curse. What, what is the curse, by the way? Is that the thing that stops anyone but the Nerevarine from wearing it or something? But you're seeing a pattern here. We're, we're, we're after a bunch of items that apparently have something to do with the Dragonborn. And of course, as we both know, I'm, turns out I'm, you know, Dragonborn. 
I mean, it's pretty hard to deny it at this point. I do seem to be absorbing dragon souls, which is, you know, a pretty big giveaway, apparently. Does this seem oddly convenient to you? Like, fate is doing its thing again, which is kind of annoying. But it's kind of annoying and getting us relics at the same time, so I'm really torn about how I feel about it. Hello? Need a ride? Yes, we would like to go to Falkreath. <laughs> right. Thank you for the welcoming committee, as usual. It was much appreciated. Your Thane appreciates your uh, attentions. Right. I was about to say, maybe, seeing as it's not too far away from here, we should possibly go and buff up a little. And I'm thinking that really is a jolly good idea for many other reasons, too. We've got about 20 minutes on the resists and fortifies. I fortified sneaking as well because we may want to stalk this hunter. Now, we need to head... Okay, that is definitely a dragon. And that may well be exactly where we need to go. Okay, you know what? In fact, I'm pretty sure that is where we want to go. We need... Or not quite. No, we're heading off. Okay, you know what? Right. Um, I'm going to just... Just in case, I'm going to get ready. Right. Um, Dernavir and... Have I got my... Cr yes, I do. Uh, right. Let's just... Just in... Just in... Case. You stay here. Whistle if you need me, okay? Yeah, no, if I need you, I will be screaming very, very loudly. Trust me, you, you will know if I need you. Okay. The old sanctuary is there. There should be a ruin somewhere in that direction. Okay. And our quarry... Right, ruin. Is over there. Okay, no, it's not quite the... the I was about to say... I was about to say I think the dragon's over there, but... Okay. He's over there, which is exactly where I need to be. Okay, that's not good. Right, so this, this is the ruin. We've been here before. I think. Right, has this got... There is an entrance. This could be used as cover, I suppose. Let's just... Oh. What did I see? A dead bandit. Okay. Right, we could possibly use this for cover in an emergency. Ooh. Is my night vision still up? It is, okay. I'm getting a very creepy feeling in here. Okay. This feels like a trap. Nope. 
No. We've been here before a long time ago, I think, but, uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, I should get a move on before my resistance fortifies drop. Okay. Okay, so. We've got some sort of building for cover here. Although, we probably could just run back to Falkyrie. We might not need to. If I can find this hunter and take him out quietly. Could I just steal the bow from him? I mean... Surely nocturnal... No, would actually... Okay, appreciate that. Oh, 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 oh. That's a bear, that's a bear, that's a bear. That's a... That's a dragon. That's a dragon fighting a bear. That's a dragon fighting a bear. That's a... Wait. The... Oh, you're kidding. There's two dragons? This looks like a... Oh, this looks like a hunter's camp. Okay, that hunter? Is he shooting at me? Or is he shooting at the dragon? Oh. Okay, he's fighting a dragon. He's actually fighting a dragon. You know what? This could work. I could just stay out of sight. Out of sight. Let the dragon do his thing. Make sure you stay out of sight. Okay, you know what? Let's have invisibility and cover. Oh, is he dead? Did you... Okay. Yes! Thank you! Don't thank the dragon just as of yet. Is that who I'm looking for? Hey! In a way, you could even... Yes! Okay, and... Right! Uh... Debella fur back, Ebony... What? You feel a precious... A presence surrounding you and some unseen force smiling upon you. And strange energy and light engulfs you and you feel the morn. The moon and star ring is no longer hostile towards you. You have Azura's blessing. Awesome. I also have some ebony arrows. Get, get out of here. Get out of here. Excellent. I mean... Oh, shit. And technically, I didn't kill Nocturnal's hero. I didn't. It wasn't me. It definitely was not me. In fact, in fact, I was coming here to warn him. Yes, I was. I was coming here to warn him of a nefarious plot. Huh. It's not really... It doesn't really matter, does it, when it comes to the Daedric princess. I was coming to warn her champion of a plot. And I got here too late. The dragon had slayed her champion, but I rescued the Bow of Shadows because I, of course, am a faithful servant of Nocturnal. I am also probably wandering off in a... No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm actually heading in the right direction. Okay. Wow, two dragons. All right. That could have gone a lot worse. Actually, I say that really well Lead the way. I got it and I didn't have to fight the dragon so we're all good bow of shadows confers the veil of shadows ability which allows the user to become invisible and move twice as fast for 30 seconds 
Okay. Uh, oh, do I tell him I found some ebony arrows? <sighs> hmm. Tempting. Right. Um. I also apparently can now wear the. I tell you what. Why don't Why don't we Why don't we check all this out back in Valkyrie? Yeah, that sound good. We can get the inn. Get some food. Maybe some water. Maybe something a lot stronger. And I'll tell you all about how I managed to kill. I didn't know how I managed to rescue the Bow of Shadows from the clutches of two evil dragons who had taken out the uh, champion of Nocturnal. It was an epic tale. Or it will be once I find out the details. Okay. I'll be right here if you need anything else. Right, she had one sweet roll, but you've still got to, so you don't actually need any, and... Okay. I don't suppose you could move over there, could you, so my friend and I could sit to... Oh, dear. Didn't I save you a long Hello time again, ago? Friend. I'll never forget what you did for me. Well, this is good. I don't suppose you'd give up your seat for it. No, probably not. Okay, you know what? I will aid you if I can. Okay, right. Oh, yes, you could sit. It will be done. We have a quick, quick, light lunch. I got myself some beef. It is good to be relaxing. Oh. Join me. Okay. It is nice to take a break from battle once in a while. This is good. It's true, it's true. Just little, I just need to snack. Okay, I've got some beef and... I deserve that. Yes, I do. Okay. Out of curiosity. Yes, my friend. How are you doing? I'm thinking if you don't eat that sweet roll, I will. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm just gonna, you know, give you them as and when you need. You've still got two on you. Stop complaining. Okay, right. So, let's take stock. So we now have, where was it? The moon and star ring. Apparently I'm al allowed to wear this now. I didn't actually ever try putting it on. I never really saw the point. Is there any point in putting it on? It doesn't seem to do anything. I sort of, now I'm nervous because I mean, it did say I could, right? Yeah? I... Okay. Nedavar's legacy gained. Okay. Um... No, 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 no. Nedavar's legacy. Increase your minion command count by one. When the visage set is fully equipped, all items can be enchanted with one extra effect. I have no idea what any of that means. Increase your minion count by one. Do you feel like you could count one higher than you could before? I, I'm not calling I you- I wish my brother could have met you. You would have liked each other. Well, if it was anything like you, of course I would. Now, I'm not calling you a minion. I'm just assuming that's a sort of old-fashioned term for, you know, friend and right-hand man. Oh. We should rest while we can. We have to keep our strength up. You don't think that's for conjurers, do you? It's probably for conjurers. Okay, that's not really particularly... Right, what did I have to take off to put that... Oh. Have I put that on my left hand or something? Hmm, interesting. It would seem I'm able to wear that on one of my other fingers. And it has, uh... Oh, interesting. Oh, right! And the Bow of Shadows conveys the Veil of Shadows ability, which allows the user to become invisible and move to... I think we should try that one outside. Lead the way. Right. Um, oh, I tell you what else we have to do whilst we're here. We have to find a suspicious looking trader and then um, plot his demise. 
or her demise. I mean, there's no guarantee. You look a little pale. Hello. I'm sorry, I should really go now. Hmm. I'm not. Are we seeing anyone who doesn't really belong here? Except, you know, us. Oh, there is a graveyard here. Maybe this person would hang around a graveyard. Cuss. Now, I think you belong here and you're... Runnil? Runnil! See? I'm good with names. Not really. Oh. Is that dragon sounding awfully close again? Okay, anyway, um... Right, the bow. I'm going to equip the bow of shadow. If I gave you this bow, could you become invisible? What the f... Okay, the Bow of Shadows. Well, it's a little underwhelming, really. I was expecting something dark and daedric looking. I mean, Veil of Shadows. Let, let's see what that one was. Where is it? Um, okay, it's a power. Is it sort of a once a day thing, like the Storm Cloak of Nocturnal? Okay, let's let's give it a try. You stay there. I will be here. And I can move twice as fast, did it say? I don't feel like I'm moving twice as fast. I will I will, I will be honest with you. Twice as fast. Renders the wheel that invisible and twice as fast. Okay. Not f Oh, you don't think it means I can attack twice as fast? Either? Or does it mean sprinting? Okay. Do I have any arrows on me? Uh, okay. I really don't know how to shoot a bow. Does it mean I can shoot twice as fast? Maybe. Okay, and Ah, right. So it is it it it's it's a it's a once a day sort of thing. Thought it would be. Okay, it's kinda like my shadow of nocturnal. In fact it's very similar to the shadow of nocturnal. You can have it if you want, but honestly, I mean once a day, it's a little, you know. Okay, right. Good to see Skyrim still. Let's see if we can find this um vampire. And then plan our next move. I, I I think it's a little too early in the day to be, uh, you know, dealing with that issue. We do have a relic to find that's not too far away from here, although I suspect it's... Yes? Oh, yeah, totally not suspicious. How can you people not see that? Okay, right. Horse whistle. We... Before it becomes pitch black, need to get all the way to the Pale Cave, and then through the Pale Cave, into the Pale Pass, find the... it's a cannon model, and then get back in time to, uh, you know, do something about that person in the dark. We have been there, yes? Bone Chill Passage. No, we've we've been near to here. I think we came here and said, you know what? One day we should probably head in there and see if it's a place that has. It doesn't really look like the sort of location we're going to find a dragon priest does. Oh. This probably isn't the burial place of a dragon priest. It's possibly a passage that will lead up into the mountain to a 
dragon wall? There was, there was a dragon attack in this area. Not, not far from here, actually. I can't quite remember exactly where. Yeah, you know what? If we scour Skyrim and still haven't found the dragon priest that's got the coffer, we can, uh, we can, we can go and check that place out. But I have a feeling that is not where we're going to have to go. That's Helgen. Right, so we head up here and then we should come across the road. Yes. And then we just follow the road around now until we... Yeah, until it turns. Once it's completely turned and we've passed the, uh, the road to the Bloodlet Throne, we need to keep our eyes open for the Pale Cave. Steed. Which are, I remember was a little tough to find last time. So let's hope we have a better um, a better time finding it this time. That sentence had way too many times in it. Yes. Probably two times as many times as it should have had. It's, just, just ignore it. Ignore it. We don't need to play with the flame at Trenar. Excellent advice. Wish I'd thought of it. Um, right. It, it's, it's very close, I think. I think it is. Right, it's back there. It's back. It's back. Oh, God, you know what? Is it... I, d I don't think it's actually following us. I can't exactly remember where it was. Was it, like... Was it up there? Yeah, I'm going to have just as hard time finding it this time as I did last time. Because of course I am. Uh, I really should leave... No, it was up here. It was. It was up here. It was just a little difficult to get to. However, we got to it. Right. I hope nothing's moved in and we can just run through unmolested. Oh, i tell you what. Right, is that the... I detect light. What the... Yeah, Ice Serpent, kill it! Okay, I don't think that's alive then, because I didn't... I didn't see it on my, um... Oh, I see one! Shoot it, shoot it, hit it, kill it! Oh. Okay. Right. Is my night vision still up? Yes, it is. Right. I am going to go invisible. Forget detect life, because apparently it doesn't detect those. And I'm going to let you kill anything and everything that attempts to interfere with us, okay? Good pl- I was going to say good plan. Except I ran straight into one of them. This... Oh, oh, God! Just... 